Welcome to Quantitative Reasoning Solution Section, Book 5, page 28. And we have this problem before us. So we have this 3, 2, 5, 4, and 2. Here we have 7, 5, 9, 8, and 11. All right. So looking at this, assuming we want to get uh, 2 here, we can say um, 4. 4 times times 3 is 12, 5 times 2 is 10, so 12 minus 10 is 2. So let's try this. 8 times 7 is 56, and 9 times 5 is 45, so 56 minus 45 is 11. So as you can see, it worked. So we can uh, work with this. Let's use this as an example. We have to get 11. So we have 8 times 7 is 56. And 9 times 5 is 45. So 56 minus 45 is our 11. So to get 7, to get 7, we're going to multiply this side. 9 times 5 is 45. So 45 plus 11 is 56. So 56 divided by 8, which is the pattern out of 7, is our 7. Okay. So to get 8, we're going to do the same thing. 9 times 5 is 45. And we're going to add 11 to it, which is 56. So 56 divided by 7 is 8. Alright. So next we are going to find. We're done with this too. So let's work with this. So we can do this here. We can get to get 5. We have 8 times 7. Is 56 so 56 minus 11 is 45 so 45 divided by 9 is 5 do not forget to subscribe to this channel please subscribe so to get 9 subscribe like share those videos so that others can benefit please do that now so we have to get 9, we're going to have 8 times 7. We have 56, 56 minus 11 is 45. So 45 divided by 5 is 9. Alright, so you see our pattern worked for all. So do well to like, subscribe, share this video. Thank you very much. And bye-bye.